This morning I got in the car in Athens, West Virginia. It was a rental car. I wasn't mine. And I sat down and uh, the seat was too far back. I couldn't reach the pedals right. I couldn't find the knobs. I didn't know how to open the gas tank when I stopped the gas station. It felt uncomfortable. You guys have all felt that feeling before when you just get in a car and it doesn't fit you right. Uh, that's how last year felt for the most part uh, for me. Just never clicked right. We had a lot of adversity. Uh, we had some things that uh, almost happened. And uh, the bottom line was uh, this off season, we got back, we got right, and, and things were moving uh, in a much better direction. What we did was basically set the standard. We expected our uh, student athletes and coaches and everyone in the program and around the building to follow. And uh, that we, if we follow through on the effort, the attitude, the commitment, it was all coming back to where we needed it to be. And, uh, you know, I, I think that uh, you just take a breath, you evaluate what went on in the season before, uh, you see what you have, and uh, you make some moves. Uh, the bottom line is, uh, when I look at the offense and the defense, we have a lot of studs on our team. Uh, and I don't mean, you know, the proverbial six foot four, 300 pound football player that you might be thinking about. I'm just talking about very good lumber that you build a foundation with. And uh, every position, we've got good players, and we've got some younger players. We have to hang on those studs. And uh, in the defensive backfield, for example, uh, Jeremiah Johnson and Chandler Shepard are as good as any two corners I've ever coached uh, in our season in this league. And uh, the safeties will be new and younger, but we can hang them on the more experienced uh, people in that secondary. So we, think we feel very strong about that. Linebacker, we got Zach Malone, who's a first-team all-conference guy. And uh, we feel we can hang some of the younger linebackers uh, on him and work from there. Defensive line, same thing. You know, Dave Gainey and uh, Justin Noble, again, are very good football players. We're going to have to take our recruiting class, some of the transfers we have, and the guys we've been developing, and uh, hang them on the uh, older, more experienced players. Same thing on the offense. Uh, Derek Dresser, who's in, uh, in the audience tonight, uh, is as good, again, as offensive lineman as I've coached in a while. And uh, we've got some younger players that we're going to uh, let him help develop and, uh, and hang the responsibility on our players. Uh, at quarterback, it'll be new. And uh, we've got two uh, junior college transfers who basically are still vying for the position, even though they were in-house in the, in the winter uh, and through the spring ball era. Uh, they're, they're still going at it. So uh, that'll be an ongoing uh, battle. We also have uh, a couple of freshmen uh, that, could, that could really make a move at quarterback. And, uh, when I say that, we don't do very good. We're not very complicated in what we do. Uh, so people can come in and learn what it is we're doing relatively quick. And so we, we look for people who, you know, who have the talent, who have the right eye, who have the right heart for it, get it, make a difference. And I think that's that's very important. We have uh, 12 seniors uh, on our team who uh, have been around with me long enough to remember, uh, you know, winning the conference championship, playing the playoffs, and doing all the things that champions do. And uh, they know how it's done. And uh, again, we are counting on that leadership uh, this season to provide us to be much more competitive than we were in the season before. Uh, we have some exciting, exciting things going on. Our first three games a year are on Thursday night. We haven't played a night game in Athens in uh, several years, so that's exciting. And uh, you know, I think it's against some quality opponents, and it's going to be a great football and uh, on and off the road. Uh, so we should make that happen. Watch film for a long time on football. Um, as you can tell, probably, probably by looking at me, we've been around this league as long as anybody, and uh, this league is as good as it's ever been, and that's uh, that's the God's honest truth. And you know what wins and loses football games is not that complicated. We need to play harder than we have, and that is a commitment I make to my team, literally from the end of the season on. Is uh, you know all the schemes, everything you might be using, all the the, the talent that you might have. It's useless unless you unless you apply it and play with great intensity. That is what we're bringing to the table this year, and that is how we hope to, to make it back to the middle of the pack, top of the league, and make something happen. It's bringing excitement back to Athens.